Welcome to beautiful Coffee County. I'm Jamie Weaver, County President. Today I'm glad to introduce our County Young Farmer winners, AJ and Valerie Teal, and their kids, Blake, Caroline, and Bo. My family and I farm in Shady Grove Community in Northern Coffee County. We operate about a 1,200 acre row crop operation with consisting of corn, soybeans, and wheat. Also, we run a small dairy herd and uh, do a, a custom harvest operation in the fall. The largest part of our operation is our row crop operation. This year we, uh, we got 200 acres of corn and uh, 1,000 acres of beans. We normally have more acres of corn, but since I didn't get started till the first week of May, and, <laughs> and corn being four, less than $4, it didn't take a whole lot to me to put the bean meters in and start planting some more beans. But this year we uh, got 200 acres of corn ranging anywhere from 108 day to 116 day, day varieties. We plant mo mostly becks, but we got some cropland. Our beans, we started out with a 3.8. Um, we go up to a 5.0. Uh, majority is becks also, but we got some cropland and a few pioneers sprinkled in through there. We market most of these soybeans through local elevators. Uh, occasionally, when time permits, we'll wheel haul some to Alabama and Clarksville, Tennessee. We, we didn't keep none for grain. We uh, cut it all for hay, which uh, oh, I'm very happy with, especially the past couple of weeks. I'm uh, glad that I didn't have to worry about the rain we've had with a uh, test weight and stuff. I'm happy I, I got in the hay roll. We'll use that to feed our uh, herd through the winter. Uh, with the extras, we'll sell to neighbors. We've done some custom planting this spring, uh, and then uh, uh, the custom harvesting again is like normal. I try to get, we were planting on about 950 acres custom harvesting this fall. The goal is to start the combine in September and not shut it off to December, and hopefully keep it busy all fall. Our dairy operation is not your typical dairy operation. The father stepped out of the dairy industry in 2011 and we kept our registered herd. We run about 50 head of registered animals. On the mama cows we raise uh, uh, steers. We, we buy Holstein bulls and put them on and raise, let the, our dairy animals raise our steers for us. And we hope to get uh, two sets of calves off each cow. And each cow, depends on the cow, we raise from two to four babies, depends on the cow. And we raise our heifers for our children to show in the local county fairs. Uh, we have an AI program on this herd to help the bloodlines, improve our bloodlines and keep the registered uh, process going. Uh, and then I'll get them to about 400 pounds. I've got on dairy animals, I found that I get my better price if I haul in Smith's Grove, Kentucky to the dairy auction. I normally get enough to justify the, uh, the diesel fuel to haul the extra distance to go up there. This is what I've always wanted to do since I was my kid's age and uh, I hope I can get doing it till uh, I can't do it no more and they can take over and, and I get to watch them do it. <laughs>